Hello and welcome. In this video I'll show you how to use a regular Raspberry Pi device to power a digital signage screen, uh, all with uh, regular hardware and a regular TV screen or any other screen for that matter. All you need is a Raspberry Pi, a USB-C charger, an HDMI cable and an SD card. Put them all together and you should be ready to go. So let's get started. The first thing that I'm going to do is head on over to this GitHub repository and under the release pages, I'll go ahead and take the first or the latest release and download it. With that downloading, I'll head on over to raspberrypi.org and under their software section, I'll go ahead and download the Raspberry Pi Imager tool. I'll make sure to include links in the description to these uh, two pages. While the image is still downloading, I'll go ahead and install the Raspberry Pi Imager. As soon as those two are downloaded and installed, I'll go ahead and open up Raspberry Pi Imager. Under operating system, I'll choose use custom and I'll go ahead and use my custom image that I just downloaded. For SD card, I have an SD card plugged into my computer over here. And I'll go ahead and replug it. Select that SD card and press write. It's gonna ask me for my password. So this process is going gonna, is gonna to take a couple of minutes. Um, at the end of it, uh, I'll be ready to take the SD card and plug it into, into the Raspberry Pi. All right, now to the hardware. I have a regular computer screen over here, but you could be using a TV screen or anything else that can take an HDMI cable. I have my SD card over here, and I'll plug that right into the Raspberry Pi. There we go. I've already connected the HDMI cable and I have the power cable. Plug that in as well and I'll turn on the TV screen. The first time it boots, it's going to take a minute so you have time to grab a coffee. Now I'm going to take my phone out, I'm going to go through the process of sharing the Wi-Fi credentials with the kiosk. So let's see, I have to find the kiosk. Connect to it. It's going to ask me to share my Wi Fi network with it. And I'm going to paste in the password. Great. Now the kiosk is going to connect itself to the internet and it's going to install some updates. So this might take another moment. When it's all done, I should just be able to see this pairing screen, and that means that it's ready to receive content. With the TV screen right behind me, I'm going to head on over on my computer to www.kiosk.show, and I'm going to click the button to start kiosking. That's going to take me to the uh, login screen and sign me in. Uh, as soon as I'm logged in, I can click the button to add a screen and in the pairing code field, I'm going to paste in the code that's right behind me, which is 8691198 and pair screen, I'm going to give it a name, which uh, orientation is the screen, in my case it's horizontal, so I'm going to choose horizontal. Do I see a red border around the screen? Yes, I do see a bo red border around the screen. And it's going to ask me to choose a channel. In my case, I'm going to pick the first channel. And my content is going to start playing. And we're done. In terms of content editing, I also have, have plenty of options. I can create my own shows and add my custom content 
Um, for example, today we're going to have uh, pizza at the office for lunch. So I'm going to create my own pizza show telling people that uh, pizza for lunch today. Enjoy. And I'm going to choose a pizza image. I'm going to style it nicely and I'm going to send it over to my screen. And as you can see, my show is playing on the screen right away. There's also quite a few options that you get uh, for the type of content that you can play with. Uh, there's YouTube videos, there's GIFs, there's announcements, there's weather. So have a look around and play with it. At this point, we're pretty much done. I hope you found the video useful and I hope you got inspired to make your own kiosk and get your own content up on the screens and share it with your colleagues. Thank you very much and enjoy!